Hey everyone, it's your girl Twin D and thank you for stopping by my channel. I have a special message for the masculines today and I have been trying to get this message recorded like maybe four times and it hasn't gone through. Now this is my last try and I do hope that it goes through. <laughs> Okay, guys, to start off, I was doing a message for the masculines where their feminines were trying to give them a message to let them know what they're feeling and what's going on, what's going on on their side. And I got these four messages. The first one. Your feminine is saying to please unblock me. So those masculines who have your feminines blocked, well, this message is for you. The second one I got, you are me and I am you. We are one. So these are the feminines who have been telling your masculines that you're twin flames. You're trying to explain the whole thing to them. And they maybe have not listened to you. Or these masculines just brush it off. You know how it goes when you're trying to explain something that they don't really understand. So divine masculines, these are the females who are feminines who are trying to explain to you about this twin flame situation. And this message I miss the way we used to talk and text on the phone. It goes right back to these feminines here who are asking you to unblock them because they miss talking to you. They miss seeing you. They just miss you overall. And then you have this message here. I know you love me because I see it in your eyes. So it's like two sets of Feminines here because this one also goes back to this one. Because it's like she's explaining to you, Divine Masculine, what a twin flame is, what's going on. And you weren't putting out any emotions. You were showing her the love that you have for her. You were hiding it. But then she's saying to you that she knows that you do love her. Because when she looks into your eyes, she can see it. She can see it. And then when I ask what more the, di the Divine Feminine has to say, I got these cards. The first one I got was, it's not the right time. So there are some Feminines out there who know that this, this exact moment is not the right time for the Masculine to come back in because I guess these feminines are the ones who are far, farther ahead on their journey and they, they realize what's going on in the journey and realize that it's not yet time for their masculine to be with them because they know they have a lot to clear. Or maybe just this one thing to clear and they're waiting on that one thing to be cleared so their masculine can finally be with them. But these feminines, they know, divine masculine, that the love you have for them and the love that they have for you is true love. This is true love and it will never die. They're holding on to you so tightly, they're not going to let you go. And divine masculines, you're doing the same thing. That's why you're here. You know this is true love. You know this is something that you can't explain. You know this feeling that you're having. This is true love. And then you have the loyal card. This shows up a lot in my Divine Masculine readings and is here in the Divine Feminine reading. So she will never, ever leave you. She will be there for you. She will be loyal to you, Divine Masculine. She will never leave you. She will, there be, will be there to support you 
in whatever it is that you need. You'll be there to support her. She'll watch your back. You'll watch her back. You two will create abundance together. You two may even be having children together. With this nurture card. And this is also telling you that these feminines are nurturing themselves. They are, they are standing in their power. They are being the empresses that they are. They are working on themselves because while they work on, their, on themselves, it reflects on you, Divine Masculine, and you in turn work on yourself. And that pulls you two together closer. But there are some feminines who are going through heartbreak. And there you go, five, five, five. So that's a change. A big change is going to come up regarding this heartbreak. But these divine feminines are going through heartbreak because they are not near you. You're not th near them. You may have blocked them, as they say here. And that's hurting them so badly. Heartbroken that you walked away from them for somebody else. Heartbroken that promises were made and never kept. But she knows that that was for a special reason. Reasons that it had to happen. It had to happen to change the situation. For you to change yourselves and learn to appreciate your feminine and also for your feminine to learn to appreciate you and appreciate themselves and allow things to work out in God's timing and not rush things. Because this is true love, it's never going to die. It's true love. It's, it's never going to die. Okay, let's see what's going, what else is on these feminine's mind. What else is on your mind, divine feminine? The fox. They felt deceived. They felt deceived by the masculines. As I said, some promises were made and they were never kept and now they feel deceived. But four and one is five here. So as I said again, a change is coming. There's a change that's going to come regarding this deception. And if you look, you have the bird here. So that's the message. Birds are messengers. So Divine Feminine, expect a message from your masculine Because what I'm getting from this, the masculines are going to communicate to you. Masculines are going to communicate with your divine feminines, explaining things as to why they occurred the way they did. And you weren't trying to deceive them at all. But things happen the way they are supposed to happen. And we couldn't do anything about it. Because with this seven, three and four, seven, it was divine intervention. It was divine intervention. God allowed things to happen. So certain things can happen. And this fish card is all about wealth. Money. So maybe this was an issue. Why the masculines couldn't come forward to the feminines, even though they made those promises. Okay. 
their finances was an issue. Thank you for the confirmation. <laughs> The child just saw 1010 endings for a new beginning. And the child card is about a new beginning. The child card is about a new beginning. And it could also be because some of these masculines, they have children and that could also be some of the reasons why they were held back, why they couldn't move forward to you, Divine Feminine. And when you look at the deception card and this new beginning, the finances in the middle could be the issue as to why this new beginning couldn't, couldn't get started. Because the masculines, they felt that they didn't, have enough money, they weren't equipped financially, 11, 11, twin flame number, baby. They felt that they weren't equipped financially to start this new beginning with you. But as I said, things are gonna change regarding that. What else, Divine Feminine? Yep. She showed up in her own reading. She showed up in her own reading. And it's a number 11. And I just said the 1111 twin flame number. So here she is wishing to be with you, Divine Masculine. Thinking about the love that you guys shared. Just reminiscing about you. That's all she can do. She thinks about you a lot. She misses you. She wants to be with you. She cannot wait for the day that you two are together again. And then on the bottom, you have the locket, which talks about bliss, love, happiness, just as I was saying. Thank you. Just as I was saying, she's just thinking about the love that you guys shared, the love that you guys had, the joy that you made her feel when you two were together, and the same joy that you felt when you two were together. You guys are actually mirroring each other right now. It's like what she's doing, Divine Masculine, you're doing. And that's because she's working on herself trying to be a, a better person for herself and then that's, that energy is going to reflect on you and you're going to do the same feeling better for yourself working on yourself to be a better person for you and that's going to help to pull you two together she cherishes the memory that you guys shared Let's get you guys some guidance messages. Give me some guidance messages for these masculines and feminines. Okay, thank you. Gifts from God. Archangel Sandalphon. We angels bring you gifts from your creator. Open your arms to receive. See that divine masculine? Your feminine is a gift from God. And if you look at the same position that they are in. But she has a rose 1414 five, five. Change is definitely coming in here. And then this gift that you're opening up your cup to receive. This love is a gift from God. This person is a gift from God. This person was made for you. Hence why it's a gift from God. Four, four, four. That's about balance. If you don't understand what these numbers mean when I say them, check my um, playlist. I have, 
a playlist um, explaining when you see, like, I have from 1 to 5. So if you see, if you're seeing 111, 222, 333, you could go watch those videos because I explain to the best of my ability <laughs> as to what each of them may mean. Then you can apply them to this reading and to your life, and then you'll better understand how the numbers come into play when you see them. So these feminines are gifts from God for you. Courage, divine masculine. Be courageous and stand up for your beliefs. Be courageous and stand up for the love that you believe in. Be courageous and move towards your divine feminine. It's not about money. You guys would be so abundant together. When you're together, you don't have to worry about money. I know you're men and you want to feel stable and you want to be able to make sure you, your, your woman gets everything that she needs and deserves. But you don't have to have a million dollars for these divine feminines. Money is not an issue with these feminines. Because they already know what you guys can create when you are together. Life review. Take inventory of your life and resolve to change or heal anything that is unbalanced. So take a look in your life, Divine Masculines. What is it that is unbalanced in my life? What is it that shouldn't be there? What is it that makes me sad instead of happy? You need to change these things. These are messages from your creator. You need to change these things in order to be fully happy. Oh, my Lord. Oh, oh, oh. Card, you can fly anywhere you want to fly. <laughs> With this message, you go anywhere you want to go. I'll, I'll come and take you up. <laughs> Victory, Divine mas Masculines. Thank you for the confirmation. I love when that happens. Archangel Sandalphon. Your prayers have been heard and answered. Have faith. You're going to have victory, divine masculines. You're going to gain the courage that you need to move forward to your, to your feminine. You're going to clear everything from your energy that doesn't serve you. Anything that doesn't make you happy. Because God wants you to have your gift. It's a blessing. And God is going to help you. To work through every and anything that doesn't make you happy. Work through clearing them. He's going to help you to solve those issues. Because you're going to be victorious with your feminine. Because she wants victory. You want victory with her. God's going to make it happen. You're going to get the courage to move forward. You're going to get the courage divine masculines to communicate. You're going to get the courage divine masculines to... Go visit this feminine, the plan you had to visit, the plan you had to take her away, the plan you had to take her out. You're going to get the courage to do that. And she will not say no. On the bottom of the deck, I have sensitivity, Archangel Haniel. You are extra sensitive to energies and emotions right now. Honor yourself and your feelings. Exactly what I was saying. You're going to get the strength and courage to do whatever it is that you had planned to do. But you held back because you think, you, or you thought that your feminine would reject you. So whatever you're feeling, you can do it. Honor yourself and move towards these thoughts and ideas. God will help you and you will be victorious. There you are. You will be victorious. This has been your message, Divine Masculines. Take care of yourselves. Love you all. Bye.